Today we're coming to you with the Old Timer buoy. I received this as a Christmas present this year and thought I'd do a little video on it. Um, uh, the person that gave it to me bought it at Bymart. Um, that's a store we have here in the Pacific Northwest. Uh, I believe they have stores in Washington, Idaho, and Oregon. Um, and it was about $20, he said, um, at that store. Um, I'll also try to find a link to put in the description below where you can pick it up online somewhere. Um, so there's the packaging there. I'll have some stills at the end that have a little better picture of the packaging if you want to check that out. Um, I have previously opened this as it was a Christmas gift, so excuse the already unboxed. So we'll pull the knife out and the sheath and we'll set this packaging to the side. Set the sheath to the side for now. Came with a little tip protector on it. All right, so this is by Old Timer and it's called the buoy. It's a 10 and a half inch blade. It's got an overall length of 15 inches. Uh, it's made from 7CR steel the blade is um, which is not a real high-end steel but it's a $20 knife so um, there's that uh, the sheath is a nylon sheath nothing special it is riveted uh, and stitched has a velcro and a, and a snap here I'm not sure exactly how this velcro is supposed to work um, but snap and we'll see how it fits in the sheath here seems to fit pretty good doesn't slide back and forth too much so we'll set that sheath to the side um, it is a hollow grind um, 10.4 ounces is the weight on this knife. Um, it has an imitation bone, uh, what they call a saw cut handle, um, which is kind of, you'll see that on just about every traditional old timer knife. That's kind of their go-to um, handle. Um, they do make a few knives with just a standard polymer handle, but uh, that's, when you think old timer, that's the kind of handle you think of. So, and then it does have this brass hilt guard. Um, so for 20 bucks, you know, it's, it's pretty cool. Uh, um, you know, it's definitely not, you know, a handmade buoy. Um, it's relatively thick for a $20 knife, although that's, that's, you know, it would make a great little, you know, low dollar machete. Um, so there it is. Uh, if you found any value in this video or uh, any enter entertainment or uh, education on it, um, please feel free to um, like the video. Uh, if you want to see more videos like this, you can subscribe to my channel. And if you click the notification bell after subscribing, you will be notified anytime I post a new video. Um, I try to post a video once a week. so. Uh, Check that out. Um, thank you and have a wonderful day.